Many people try a cleanse or a detox to rid themselves of toxins or inflammation uh, to kickstart a health goal. The reality is there's only one real way to cleanse your body, and that's what I'm talking about in this video. My name is Joe, I'm a dietitian. I run the world's leading online dietitian consulting company. If you've been feeling like you need a health kickstart lately and you're considering cleanse or detox, or perhaps you've tried them in the past, then this video is especially for you. So here's the thing, cleanses, detoxes, they sound sexy. Like, I get it, I'm, I'm a marketer. What I'm doing right now, this video, it's marketing. I'm always wearing a marketing hat. I get it. The offers are irresistible, like fast weight loss, you know, lightning fast weight loss, without having to do anything else other than blitz a smoothie, right, or juice. Glowing skin, longer life, like promising longer life. Like that shit sounds good, like I get it, but it's not true. If it were true, then I would be doing that and I would be promoting that. The reality is like a juice cleanse, like it's gonna clean out your colon, yeah? It's gonna make you take a shit or several, uh, but that's all it cleanses. It's not cleansing your, it's not cleansing your body. In fact, your body has its own inbuilt detoxing and cleansing mechanisms. And it's been doing that for you since you were born. The amazing human body, for real, your, your lungs, your liver, your kidney, your digestive and immune systems, they are constantly working to remove and detox harmful substances out of your body. Here's an example. Your liver breaks down toxic substances that enter your bloodstream. For example, alcohol, right? It's toxic, it's a toxin. Your, the human body cannot store it, it has to remove it, it is a toxin. Uh, the liver helps break it down into substance or, or molecules that can then be excreted via your urine uh, thanks to the kidneys. We can even breathe toxins out through our lungs. So these are, the, these are examples of our inbuilt filtration cleansing systems. If they didn't, if yours weren't working, you'd be dead. So if you're trying to cleanse or detox and that's where your focus is, you're, you're really looking at the wrong end of the spectrum or the, I don't know, the stick. You, you need to be up this end. Like forget what you did in the past and stop trying to repair that. You need to look ahead and think about, okay, my lifestyle and, ha and habits, what aspects there are not in line with my overall health goals and going forward, how can I uh, improve gradually each one of those things to a point where I don't feel like I need to detox and cleanse. And in my experience for 99% of us, this way looks like stop Drinking like a college student, perhaps tone it down a little bit, find another way to get your endorphin and serotonin hit that's more in line with long-term goals. Think about that, at least have that conversation, start thinking about it. Um, stop eating like a seven-year-old, especially on the, the weekends. Uh, there is room for that, yeah, but we're, we're doing it too much all the time. Uh, and then it, it makes us focus here. Oh, okay, this happened. I need to, you know, drink celery juice now and that makes it all better. No, you're, you're doing it backwards. You're gonna get nowhere. And so, yeah, the best method for cleansing and detoxing then is kind of looking forward uh, at how can I change my choices rather than this knee-jerk reaction of, oh, I, you know, I had a bender. I need to drink celery juice and, and then it, it's all better because, yeah, you're, you're digging your own hole. Anywho, that was a bit of a rant. If you found it useful, make sure you give us a thumb up or a heart and uh, give me a follow or a, or a subscribe or whatever we call it uh, if you want to see more content like this.